What's going on guys? Josh here. I am joshrussell.com. I'm back with another unboxing. It has been a long time since I've done an unboxing video. Actually like well over a year because I've been in the studio, the new studio over a year and we haven't done an unboxing in here yet. So this is the first one and boy am I excited for this one. This is the brand new Westcott FJ200. It was sent over to me to uh, test and use in my classes with my uh, all the conventions and stuff that I hope to be doing this year and next year and beyond uh, but yeah they sent it over to me I am NOT getting paid to do this unboxing uh, but yeah I just wanted to show it to you I want to give you my honest thoughts about it just the unboxing portion of it I'm gonna have more videos coming out using this and uh, using it with my FJ 400 and the FJ 80 that I'm gonna borrow off Brad he doesn't know it but yeah so we're gonna be doing some uh, some tests with this but this is just unboxing there's a ton of videos out there already about this product that you can go watch uh, go over to fjwestcott.com, check out some of their videos as far as behind the scenes and stuff like that. This is just an unboxing. I want to show you guys what it looks like when you get a quality product from Westcott and how they uh, will give it to you, how, how it's displayed when you get it, and basically let you guys know what you're going to be getting when you get the box and so you can be prepared. So let's go into it right away. Like I said, this is the FJ200, 200, 200 watt strobe. Uh, it's great for uh, off-camera flash and uh, traveling. It's supposed to be super light. Uh, I will let you know that I have unboxed this already, looked at it, made sure everything was here, put it all back together. And truth be told, I actually filmed this once already. And now we're filming it again because, yeah, uh, I don't want to talk about that. But yeah, we're going to unbox this and show it to you. So let's get into it right away. No more fluff. Uh, Right away, when you open it, you notice this super awesome bag that it comes with, this very nice tote that pretty much has everything in it for you to look at right when you open it. So let's, 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 let's just do this, okay? It's like gonna be like gold light coming out of it and like, oh, no, okay. Here it is. This is the FJ200 instructions right away. And as you know, we don't use those here. Uh, we just kind of shoot from the hip, as you will call it. Uh, first thing first, we have a USB-A to USB-C cord. I'm assuming that is for firmware updates and all of that good jazz. I can't really think of any other reason you'd need it other than to do uh, firmware updates. Next, we will get into a uh, power cord, which I'm assuming the power cord goes for, oh, did you hear that? Bubble wrap. Yeah. Yep, this is what I thought it was. This is the uh, charging station for the battery. So the battery just sits down in here and then this will plug into the side here and you got your charging station. This is really similar as far as the looks to the uh, West or the Godox AD200. Uh, it looks really similar, a little bit smaller. I, know, I noticed that the battery is probably gonna be a little bit smaller. Now, I don't think that means that it's a weaker battery. I think they just figured out how to get it into a smaller footprint. So, got that. Uh, the next one thing we got here is the light stand adapter. Maybe. So we have the light stand adapter here, which has a quarter 20 screw on one end of it, and then it has your light stand adapter on the other end of it. Now, another cool thing that I noticed about this is it has the degrees written on the side of it. I don't know if you guys can kind of see it in the overhead, but there are degrees here. And what those will allow you to do is set the exact degree you want your light when it's on that light stand. So if you want it at 45 degrees, if you want it at 90 degrees, this kind of helps you fine tune so you know if you're uh, a math nerd kind of like I am when it comes to lighting and angles and stuff like that, it'll help you get that figured out and tied down where you want it to be. So, and I should say that this is also seems to be very, very high quality plastic. Most, some of it's metal, uh, the hinges are metal or the screw through it is metal, the quarter 20 is metal. The rest of it is, is plastic, but it seems to be like a cast plastic where it's thicker. Uh, and there is also um, a hole for the umbrella. So if you're using an umbrella mount or an umbrella diffuser, it'll go right through there. And I can tell by looking in it that it's one of those like uh, clamp styles where it kind of pushes up and then pushes it, holds it in. Uh, there's no screw on the side to tighten it, but yeah. Next thing we got here is the battery. 
which is the FJ FJ 200 battery, 2,500 milliamp. Uh, I don't, right off the top of my head, remember the specs as far as what this gets for full power flashes. But like I said, there are plenty of videos about this and I will be doing some more detailed like uh, behind the scenes and tutorial videos with this and comparisons. We're also gonna compare this to a couple other travel flashes. So yeah, there's the battery comes with it. And like I said, the battery will just go down into the charging dock like that. And there is a percentage spot right on the battery housing or the charger housing showing you how much battery you have left. The next thing we have here is the diffuser, which is really cool because it comes with this magnetic uh, clamp around the outside of it. And it also holds in the, the, uh, the diffuser, the uh, grid. So it does come with the grid, which pops in and out. It is kind of a pain in the butt to get in and out, but it will pop out because it'll allow you to use this as it's magnetic. It'll allow you to use it to hold in gels with, with or without the, the grid in it. So if you do not want, want to put the grid in, you don't have to, you can use it just like this magnetic. And then it just goes back on your diffuser like this. I do really enjoy the fact that these have micro Bowens or mini Bowens mounts. They're just so cute and they look like a normal big boy light, but they're just smaller. And the last thing we have here is the piece de resistance, the bad boy itself, the FJ 200, 200 watt travel light, smaller light with the FJ ecosystem. It's so cool because these things just basically seamlessly work with all of the lights. Like I said, the FJ400, the FJ80, the FJ200, they all just work so perfect together. I tried some quick stuff before I put it all back together and unboxed or for the unboxing and everything was just working so seamlessly together. It worked with the, the trigger and everything just straight out of the box. It was awesome. So this is it. As you can see, there's the control panel on the back, the big old LED and the flash bulb right here on it. And like I said, just an unboxing, I wanna show you guys what's in here. And I, I should say that it does come with this diffuser. Uh, there is also a dome uh, accessory you can buy on it. Uh, when do you guys wanna throw me the dome, please? Not as good a throw as the last time we recorded this. So this is the dome. This is the diffusion dome. And I will show it to you real quick. Like I said, this is additional. It is, uh, it is a, $20 add-on and this is the dome right here. So like I said, it fits on just like the diffuser does. It's the micro Bowens and it will clip down in like that. And so then this is kind of like a Gary Fong light sphere or something similar to that where the flash is going to be diffused more everywhere instead of this where it's going to be more guided. And then with the grid on it as well, it's even going to be even more guided. So yeah, this is a nice little add-on, especially if you're traveling and you're going to be shooting outside and you want to get close, but you want to light up, this is what you're going to want to use. There's one more thing in here, and actually the last time we recorded this, I completely forgot to mention them. And that is up in here in the upper portion here. Let me uh, get in screen here. In the upper portion here, there's a zipper spot that comes with gels. So you're going to get five gels here, I think, maybe six. You are going to get with this, you're going to get a yellow one. You're going to get a red one. You just get a diffused one. So like a frosted clear one, uh, the blue one. Then you're going to get a color temperature orange, a CTO one. So to add that uh, nice daylight look to it or the tungsten look, I should say. And then you get a green one. So you do get, how many is that? One, two, three, four, five, six. I was right. Don't, don't question me on that. Uh, I was right. I'm always right. Uh, but yeah, you get six of those. And then, like I said, so what these are going to do is these are going to, you just pop this magnetic portion open right here and put your diffuser down and then close it up. And now you have a diffused light instead of just a bare bulb daylight light. So yeah, that is what comes in the box and uh, the additional diffuser as well. Now they do make a snoot too which is the same thing. It's just a, uh, a snoot that comes down and allows you to aim the light even more. I didn't get that. I just got the diffuser dome. Uh, this is what comes in the box. 
If you want to buy it, I'll put the link down in the description below. Also, if you want a discount code for 15% off your entire order at FJ Westcott, all you have to do is either comment with your email address or send me an email. I'll put that link down in the description down below as well. Uh, my friends like it when I say uh, the doobly-doo down below. So if you're looking at the doobly-doo, you'll find all my information down there. Otherwise, big shout out to Westcott for uh, letting me see this, letting me play with it and uh, having fun with it. I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Like I said, more unboxing coming. Make sure you hit that subscribe button and the bell notification. That way you're notified when I go live, when I do these videos and pretty much everything in between. I'll talk to you guys later. Peace. Step really short, take one.